Hello guys, this is TechRover. In this quick tutorial video, I just want to show you how to transfer your files from your iPhone to Android device or from your Android device to your iPhone. For example, your photos, videos, music, anything you want, you can transfer now with an application. I just want to show you now in the Play Store of your Android device, you have to download it to use and to transfer it. So here we go, we're gonna write here extender and once you got an in extender here in your play store just open it and install this application to your Android device. <coughs> now as you can see I installed the application now I'm going to install this application to my iPhone and here we go I installed. There is the extender in app store of your iPhone you can search for free and which is here let me check for the extender search bar and type in here extender pardon extender and then go into the extender which you wrote on and there you go i installed the application to my iphone also and i can use it now in my battle phone to transfer my files so we're gonna open the extender before this all but you have to turn off all your Wi-Fi, mobile data or mobile hotspot, anything. First of all, let's check for the extender here in our phones. As you can see in my Android device and iPhone. But before that, let's turn off all my uh, Wi-Fi and also mobile hotspot, um, uh, mobile data, anything we have here in the city. For example, let me show you. Here we go. We can turn off the mobile data and mobile hotspot, and we come back to iPhone and I'm going to turn off my Wi-Fi and there you go everything turned off and it's not connected to any internet and I can use it as offline to transfer my files so I'm going to open the extender in my Android device also just as you can see I have got a lot of photos of gallery in my iPhone and also in my Android device and if I want to transfer videos, photos, anything uh, from my Android device to my iPhone, I have to connect my Android device to iPhone in Xcenter. How we can connect it? For example, before this, just click on a video and for example, mm, this one. I want to send this to, uh, for example, let's make connect before you have to get permission from the location of your Android device. Just go in here, just click on this option tick on once you got on here you go it will be available in your android device now just get out of the location and come back to extender and as you can see it's searching now just click on the receive you will get the code scanner and this is the code but where phone is not connected and it will not be work now so for example i'm going to scan the code now as you can see, it says you have to connect to the extender Wi-Fi to my Android device with my iPhone. So how we can do it? You ha I have to set the Wi-Fi. So there is the Wi-Fi ID and also password you uh, you have you can see here in my Android device. And just click on the set Wi-Fi. Then go to back in the Wi-Fi and you will see uh, the Wi-Fi option here in your I iPhone and just click on the X center which is open it's hotspot and you have to connect on that with this uh, password which is given in my android device and i'm going to type my all passwords here in my iphone to connect my iphone to my android device as a sender and to transfer my files i'm going to type the all passwords here one by one and and there you go after that our phone will be connected to each other and now I finish click on join you will see our Wi-Fi connect to my Android device on Xender hotspot just get out of here just come back to Xender close everything you open in your iPhone as Xender also just close also close this one also and open Xender again once you open just click on the uh, receive button now and you will get the code scanner and scan the code you will be connected to your Android device now in Xcender. You can see 
I received the video from my Android device. So now I can transfer whatever I have in my Android device to my iPhone and I can transfer it back to my Android device from my iPhone. For example, I want to send a lot of videos by taking all of them from my Android device one by one. You can see there I'm going to choose a lot of videos like 10, 12, 15, any, any, any video you want and here we go these these and this one also and this one click on the send it will show the icon in the right corner side about transferring once you click it will go on the right corner side and you will receive an iPhone one by one now as you can see without any internet just by connecting your uh, iPhone to Android Y with X sender so you can see my iPhone is receiving the videos and it's going to be finished. I received too much videos now in my iPhone. I can play one by one. You can see there are a lot of videos and I'm receiving the other ones also. It's going to be finished in two minutes and it's the fastest way to transfer whatever you have in your Android device to iPhone. So let me zoom the video and we will see we will play the video or let me check for a video I tried, I got from my Android device. Mm, I'm going to play the video here. You can see this is the video I got from my Android device. I transferred to my iPhone. So, for example, the other one we can play here the PUBG video I opened in my Android device. As you can see, it's here now in my iPhone. So now this one also. Uh, you know, PUBG is my favorite game, and I play every day and that's why i record a lot of videos uh, and i'm just planning to make uh, videos on my channel about the games and anyway we're gonna play another video also for test these are the videos i received from my android device and i'm going to check for uh, music uh, i want to transfer the music from my android device to my iphone and let me scroll down and let me find my favorite music. Let me see. Oh my god, there's too much voice records in my Android device. And I'm going. Oh, sorry. Let me untick this ones. These are the voice records. I'm going down, scrolling down. Not this one, not this voice. Scroll down, down, down. We are going down. Oh my god, I have to delete all of the voice records from my inner device. It's just gotten too much clips. Anyway, we are here with the music, with my favorite music, with the, uh, this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one, this one, this one, this, and Michael Jackson also, this. I've chosen a lot of music now. I'm just waiting. There you can see there's a red uh, icon just giving me alert about transferring files to iPhone. As you can see, I receive the music. So if I play, as you can see, it's playing now. But I cut the voice, uh, I, the music of the video. Sorry for that. But <laughs> these are the videos. These are the musics and videos I received from my Android device. This is the music. Yeah. So. Anyway, it's now receiving one by one, it's all finished and I can play, I can use uh, in my iPhone also as same, very easy. Now we come back to photos. If you want to transfer photos, it's also very easy, like by clicking on them, by selecting them, sorry, it's the photo I just got on uh, for my mobile layer again mobile legend game that i have gotten a mystic mythic last week and this is the rings photos and this one this one this one this one sorry and this one this oh sorry i'm sorry about the miss selecting this one this one this one and there we go i'm going to click on send everything gone to my iPhone and I'm waiting for photos you can see all I all receive a lot of photos from my I and the device in my iPhone I'm going to open it this is the ring photo I transfer from my iPhone uh, from my Android device to my iPhone sorry and <coughs> and there we go this is the photos I received from my Android device 
and how you can transfer the files from your iPhone to Android device. It's also same like very easy. You can transfer it uh, by doing the same thing which I did on my Android device. And uh, let's see the photos before and this all photos I received from my Android device. And we come back here to iPhone to send any file from the gallery of iPhone. Okay. Now let's see what we have in gallery these are the videos photos and for example uh, this is a camera roll I want to transfer this video to my uh, Android device you have just click on the send you can see I receive it on my Android device you can see there is the video I just uh, show you oh sorry I transferred again <laughs> anyway I'm going to play in both of my phones you can see this is the same videos I transfer from my iPhone to Android device and I'm going to send this one also to my Android device as you can see here we are and this is the video and there you go we're gonna close it and about uh, this one also just click on the send you can see this is the video it is about the small text video I'm just going to send it to my Android device and just by clicking on the send you will see this is appearing in my Android device I'm going to play here we go it is very amazing where you can transfer and now all your files from your iPhone to Android device and from your Android device to iPhone and without any internet, Wi-Fi or any connection you just need to connect your iPhone to Android device as the extender and for example for photos I'm going to transfer some photos here and from my uh, iPhone to my Android device and I'm going to click on this one, this one, this one and send you, can, you will see I receive a lot of them, all of them you can see sorry my Android device is a little low it's just it's, it's very low now here you can see this is the photo here in my iPhone but I got it in my Android device yeah, yeah. so and this is the photos I captured with my iPhone but I transferred to my Android device and here you go guys it was a very easy way to transfer your files but you know guys one more thing photos will directly save in your camera roll but the videos you have to do save it from the extender how you can do it I will show you for for first time we're gonna check out for the photos which is just directly save it in my iPhone you can see these are the photos which is directly save it and I have to uh, here you can see in the camera roll but actually uh, extender save uh, the videos also in the camera roll but uh, by the way if it uh, didn't save it you just come to video you want to save it just click on that just keep press pardon keep pressing just two seconds you will get the option here to save your files for example let me show you just I'm going to click keep pressing just two seconds I will get the save to album when I got in press on the save to album it will be directly moved from your Xender to your gallery and it will be disappeared from your Xender file file manager anyway we're going to save one by one you can see it just it's all going into camera roll and there you go this is the videos I just uh, save it now from my Xender to my camera roll in my iPhone you can see this is the PUBG game which is very famous and beloved game and I'm going to get out of here just going to check for other videos also and this is also a small short video I transferred from my Android device to my iPhone and this is another PUBG game video I transferred from my Android device to my iPhone and you can do what you want as I did here in my video hope you're gonna enjoy the video my friends if you like the video please like it if you uh, gonna share it with your friends I will be so happy and don't forget to subscribe to my channel see you on next quick tutorial videos bye bye peace <laughs>